Are you prepared Shake to off. enter a phase of existence where you're not distracted by anything? <laughs> no. Because that that's where the, the ultimate test of your soul comes in. That's where you're facing eye to eye with, hey, it's mom, <laughs> can I have another dollar? <laughs> Never mind what we were talking about just now. <laughs> it's time for LA Machine Guns. Yeah, Rage, Rage of, of the, the Machines. machines. Oh. Isn't that what Terminator 3 was called or something? Or, or maybe <laughs> Rise of the Machines. Hey, I gotta kill the president, apparently. Destroyed target in the... Yeah, I guess so. We have received... How do you uh, know he's the president? He might be the governor. Uh, or the mayor or some other stupid uh, shit. Uh, dude, I just basically go off it says the president. public opinion. The president of what? It doesn't say. It just says the president. It, you're of Los Angeles. You're extracting the president, you fuck. He is president. Holy <laughs> shit. Oh, this is just no. an average day in fucking Ventura Boulevard, though. Oh, kill these fucks. You see these guys all the time. Oh, shit. Kill him. Shit like that. You, you go to a Stout Burger in Hollywood, and you just get a window seat, and you just watch the show. Yeah. No shit, I was. <laughs> actually, I was getting lunch in Hollywood once, and I... And you witnessed a just, Hollywood shootout? Almost. I just looked with out the window. Jetpack weirdos blowing up a bridge. Well, no, <laughs> but I did see a guy with, like, neon green hair getting slammed into a police car. <laughs> oh, good God. That's just the sort of thing that you're going to catch, like, with a 50-50 uh, likelihood anytime you glance up from something. Jesus Christ. In yeah, Hollywood. Dude, this, this is... Like an exact definition of an eye fuck. What? Like, there's so much going on. I don't think it is. Oh. I don't believe that oh. to be accurate. Eye fuck with like a Y in it. I thought you meant yeah. like a, a, uh, one yeah, of the no. lesser known Steve Jobs products. <laughs> <laughs> one that yeah. I would buy. Oh. <laughs> I, iPod, eye fuck. Their, 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 their ad campaign could be I don't give a fuck. Or no, <laughs> that, that'd be like a very. Topical I don't line. give a fuck for less than eight hundred dollars. <laughs> that, yeah. That's a bit tall. That's a tall order. Oh man, Nick, I think uh, it's an Apple product. That's accurate. Oh right, yeah, right, right. No, dude, seriously, I made a their mistake. fucking iPhone Seven costs like five hundred bucks. I think that's a lot. Yeah, for a goddamn phone that you're gonna drop anyway. Yeah, especially yeah. one that even if you take immaculate care of it, it's gonna be obsolete in fucking two years. Yeah, I think they're already working on the iPhone 7s. Of they're, they're, they're I mean, they're at this point, when this episode comes out, they're probably already working on the iPhone 8. No, they're probably yeah. I guess on what it, yeah. it does exactly the same goddamn bullshit that it did Ex for the last eight generations. Except they took away features. They're already yeah. working on the <laughs> iPhone 23. You fuck. What are you? You're not thinking down the line. These guys, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. these guys, got to keep the stock prices oh. going up for for a thousand years. I mean, I will say I, I spent more than that to uh, to get the Google phone, but I'm also on their service. Yeah. So as long as I stay on Wi-Fi, I could seriously spend less than thirty bucks. Apparently, that shit works anywhere in the world that you want. Uh, yeah, yeah, you can t you can, like, you don't even have to set anything up. It will just let you uh, fire sounds, up anywhere on the planet. Sounds heavenly. So the first time, check this out. So normally when I travel, I usually just do the Wi-Fi thing, and I'm just like connect, disconnected from the world forever. Yep. Uh, but this time, to be. Uh, I went to Argentina with my girlfriend before we went to Antarctica. And you ended up raining hellfire on the president. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Uh, no, but um, so I'm on her mother's plane because she uh, has a way better plan. Because it's impossible to be a single person and have your own cell phone plan and not pay a billion dollars. But I'm on their, uh, her family's plan, and they, they, she's like, oh, can you please get us some international calling so we can... Um, so we can like call you guys if an emergency happens. Mm, and so I was using um, roaming the entire time I was there, and it didn't cost anything extra. But it was weird just to be able to be like, oh, shit, I need to look up something right now, and I'm in a foreign country, because that's literally never been the way I travel. Oh, yeah. Kyle, was the whole story literally that you got a phone to work in another country? <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God, I was really banking on something fucking crazy happening. Oh, <laughs> shit. Oh, okay, and then uh, so ah. I was trying to upload a video on Facebook, and it wouldn't work. So we went to a cafe, and then I asked if I could use their Wi-Fi, and so they let me. And then uh, as I was uploading the video, the uh, the network crashed was, and like oh, yeah. turned off. And their so you just had to sit there and ask a bunch of gas station attendants, like, "Do cashews really come off of an apple, or is it a nut like a peanut?" Uh, no, no, my story is a little bit, little slightly more, less interesting than I, that. Yeah, exactly. That's why I <laughs> cut you off. Your story. No, no, sucks. no, no. You didn't. God damn it! I told the story earlier, Keith. Right? Not on the show, so no. it doesn't count. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. Like uh, and subscribe. That's why I'm if trying you like to save everybody stories. else the hassle. No, so I, 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 I uh, so their entire system went down. And I'm like, shit, was that me? Because like it knocked out their their music and knocked out their actual like paying payment systems. So as a scientist, I am. I and decided, the lights and stuff too. Yeah. Well, no, all the stuff that was running oh. off the network. Oh, so as a scientist, you. I am. I decided to say, hmm, let's see if that was me. So I did it again three more times, and each time it crashed. So I was like, hmm, it's safe to say that it was me. 
but it uh, cost them literally tens of dollars. Yeah, Kyle, probably. No, <laughs> I was expecting you to like intercept a call intended for Adolf Hitler or something. <laughs> <laughs> You're in Argentina, for God's sake, right. and he didn't even have a Nazi story to show for it. Uh, everybody How there was German for some reason. Uh, well, some there's, reason. There's, <laughs> yeah. There's I can't, a couldn't explain reason. it. Ran into a lot of German people on this trip, too. I guess it all depends on... Well, you know what? Australia and Germany, of all the, those two countries, those fuckers, yeah. those sons of bitches, you it's know what they got? They got this deal going. I don't know exactly how it works, but apparently uh, you can just take, like... Press start. You can take, like, a year off of work and get paid and just travel all you want. Yeah, um, in New Zealand, we kept running into fucking Germans everywhere. Yeah. yeah! That's why you run into so many Aussies every place. And why they're always like, oh, yeah, I've been traveling for 10 months. You know, well, like, every time I meet them, like when I was over there, like, yeah, I've been working on a far farm for three months. Well, that's a little different. That's like a workaway type thing. It's kind of right. what I did, but huh, didn't work on a farm. Have, shit, that, fuck that. I couldn't. I'd fuck that up. <laughs> I'm only responsible for fucking so what, what killing did you an do, animal. Keith? I told I already. I think I worked at a, uh, I did tutoring and I worked at a oh, couple God. of hostels. Oh, fuck. You a couple tutored? of hostels. Yeah, English. Oh, I'm very Jesus good at Christ. English. I have all the best I hope words. you weren't teaching them spelling. <laughs> yeah. Well, what the fuck did, were you teaching them? Like how to say bananas town and stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> a you know phrase I mean? literally no one outside of you and your fuckos up, up in the Northeast say that. Mm, no. I've never heard anybody me. say bananas town. Uh, the last psychiatrist used it, therefore it's a great term. <laughs> Therefore, okay. nobody's ever heard in their lives. <laughs> yeah. That's fine, because when these kids deploy in a situation where they're speaking English, they're going to be like, damn, that's some good English. No, they're like, going to say, I'm sorry, what? They're going to be like, I'm Somebody sorry. taught you wrong, son. <laughs> we and didn't for that, they you. should pay. It's We're like that time I hire you for the job, and they'll be like, damn, this is bananas town. It's like that time I went bowling uh, when we were in San Angelo, and uh, there, there was a bunch of Koreans from the, uh, the local college. And somebody had taught them. So they said, well, hey, what's like a phrase I can say in English when I miss both the, uh, the pins? And then uh, someone goes, ah, just say shit. So um, I didn't hear that part. And then uh, all of a sudden, uh, one of them hits a gutter ball. And then I hear like 10 Koreans in unison just shout, shit. <laughs> <laughs> See? Yeah. That's the kind of thing that that'll, that'll, that worked well. And then when someone actually explained to them what it meant, they were horrified. Yeah. Uh, well, I mean, you could have given them the gift of fuck, <laughs> and they would have been right no matter what the circumstance. I would have been a little bit more oh, creative. Oh, fuck. I would have been like Dick City. <laughs> it's, trying to just uh, it's, it's too complex. Dick City? Yeah. Eh, it's got all the same let, uh, sounds as uh, is Korean. No, it should be. Fuck. They, they don't even have an F sound. Dude. No, yeah, yeah, that's why it's so amazing. <laughs> it, should be, it should be Fuckville, Illinois. Fuckville, <laughs> Fuckville, Illinois. Fuckville County. That's uh, actually a good even if there band. was a Fuckville, Illinois, I wouldn't visit. <laughs> I've driven through a, probably about 65% of Illinois, and I have not liked what I've found. Really? I want to go to Cahokia. It, there's, well, I mean, for the most part, there's nothing there. I find the further you get from the coasts of the United States, the worse it gets. Well, I mean, it's I don't know farms. why people. Well, yeah, yeah because you, you to hate life more. It's I mean, designed to keep the rest of us alive. It's it's the battery. At, from looking the at Matrix. the water is like a, <laughs> it's a simulacrum of hope that, <laughs> that you have an escape to somewhere that's different. When you are in Dirt Town, Indiana, <laughs> oh shit, uh, there is no escape. You go from one cornfield to another, and you just. Pick which one you want to die in. <laughs> I hear, though, that there is a corn castle somewhere in Nebraska, which oh, God. I kind of want to go to and die in. <laughs> there's well, a there's a castle in Kentucky well, before that we a crazy man made. Made out of meat, like human meat. <laughs> <laughs> well, before we spin any more out of control, let's, uh, let's go ahead and split this off into the next episode of L.A. Machine Guns.